All right, people, welcome back. More D Undo commentary. So we are joined by one of our new tag partners and D Undo commentary uh, commentators. Go ahead and introduce. Who let the dogs out? Cause Fluffle Dog. Uh, uh, no, that's not my name though. My name's Forever Epic, but I kind of yeah. had to say that. <laughs> Perfect. This man is hilarious, so the link will be in the description to his channel. Go ahead and subscribe. He's, of course, invited to Season 2 of League whenever we get that organized. So uh, be sure to support him. Anyway, the end of commentary. All right, we're going to try this. We're going to try this. These people, the rating's not too high. We see the fluffs. Uh, he said a monster, so I doubt it's Cosmos. So uh, hopefully you guys will like it. All so, be good. Yeah, Naruto, Naruto the Flash, which, no. He's clearly the so, ninjas. I don't, I, yeah, I, I don't watch Naruto, but I know that's not... Naruto. That's that's uh what Minato yeah. is that is that his name? Yeah. So damn, I don't even watch Naruto. See, I know that. <laughs> I stopped watching Naruto after all the it's just started going all the filler. I just read the manga and called it a day. <laughs> like how can you watch Naruto when you can watch One Punch? Yes! <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> One Punch Man is so hyped. <laughs> so hyped. It's I so love hyped. it. Like, oh. It's so hilarious. It's, it's just beautiful. Oh my god. Uh. So Naruto the Flash at five twelve, and then we have Natty. I only Yang want to All right, Yang Zing versus Fluffles. Yang is clearly right. going to destroy the Fluffle deck by its ended. <laughs> as long as he knows what he's, he's doing. Just yeah. So are you not entertained? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> so Fluffs. I mean, did uh did Tiger get the reprint? Like, did uh, that happen yet, or is he still kind of? I expensive? think it's still expensive. Blind spacing because why not get rid of that TT? You literally wow, got, you got rid, rid of the, card the one card healthy. you didn't need to get rid of. <laughs> get rid of. <laughs> <laughs> Let me get rid of a card that's gonna help me. <laughs> that's why I don't like blind spacing. No, gonna... Like if I use MST, I'm probably gonna give you that turn. That's how I use it. Mm. That's how I like to use it. Or I'm make, gonna make yeah. some kind of like really stupid good board. Yeah, blind space. Like, if you're just gonna blind like, space why? to attack into a fluffle dog, like what you doing, some? Yeah, and a deck that kind of floats. Like, and what are you afraid of? Storming your force? Like, I'm not. I'm not gonna lie. That card makes me cry whenever I attack into it. <laughs> 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 it's like, oh, oh, look, he only has one back row. Every Yang's in attack mode. Storming mirror force. <sighs> oh, and I normal summoned and set this turn. Fuck. <laughs> And he's like, alright, well, you we don't have any monsters, I'm gonna get it in with that farm girl, and that's it. <laughs> wow. Do you have another wings? Oh my uh, god. This man is going uh, the plusage. <laughs> I don't <laughs> even this. know he how this deck works, and I know this is savage. Oh my god. Fluffle wing plus toy vendor is like the dumbest shit ever. Like, oh, you know, I remember it, playing it, against this once. It's like, oh, he draws, and then he adds, and then he draws, and then he draws, and then he draws. Uh-huh, like... No, <laughs> like f you play Toy Vendor just because of Fluffle Wing. Like it's just too good. It's just too good. It's like what you like banish it and draw two cards and like pop a uh, a Toy Vendor and then Toy Vendor will go ahead and get you your search. It's like oh my god, it's the Red Bull deck. Like yeah, this card is in your graveyard and you control a Toy Vendor. You can banish this card from your graveyard, then target one Fluffle Monster your graveyard, banish it. And if you do draw Look, one card, then send how one is he toy drawing vendor, so many control... cards? <laughs> Yeah, then you can send the Toy Vendor and you control the graveyard, and if you do, draw a card. And then Toy Vendor will go off and get you a search. That's fair. <laughs> yeah. So if you go Toy Vendor pitch fucking Fluffle Wings, then Fluffle Wings will go ahead and banish you uh, itself and another uh, Fluffle to draw a card. Then send Toy Vendor to draw a card, and then search. So you go plus like crazy. And then Toy Vendor, you discard a card, then draw a card, and then reveal a Fluffle Monster Special Summon it. And if you discard it, if it's not a fluffable card, you discard it. It's a slime. Like, it just makes you want to play Toy Vendor just because of fluffle wings. Like, look at this man's hand! Look at it! That's a hand? <laughs> wow, and he's actually playing the Dark Fusion. Not bad. Not bad. I have not seen this before. Yeah, they check it in as one of their fluffle fusion cards because Dark Fusion says the special summon monster can't be targeted by your opponent's spells, traps, or monster effects to the end of the turn. So, uh, target. Wait, he's gonna this doesn't go have to be a hero target. monster? No, it just has to what? be a, a fiend type fusion monster. That is so yeah, good. Just, just has, just has Ooh, to be but he's about type. to get Baxia. Oh, he's Ooh. about to get Baxia during your turn. I always forget oh. about that whenever I play fucking uh, Yang Zing. I'm terrible. Wait, what's what's going on? Well, he's going to destroy, so. Because it's not really open game state to do that. Because he's starting a chain with it. 
Yeah, because he's gonna fright, go call. Wait, so fight for tiger destroys. Okay. Yeah, fight for tiger destroys. <clears throat> I mean, so you're still getting backseated. What are you doing? Jatsu. Yeah, I mean, he he he's just he's... gonna go ahead and reset up his his or friends. I... Not. Are you seriously not running mm. Jatsu? Mm. Oh, there's no tuner. Oh. What are you tuner. doing? Oh my <laughs> god! I mean, backseated can't spend the freaking threat for Tiger this turn. You anyway. can attack over it. Yeah. You know what? Fright Fright Tiger is still too expensive for my taste. Get when you, you know, get under ten dollars and we'll talk. Yeah. Like I kind of still feel like cards shouldn't be more than ten dollars. Really shouldn't. <laughs> like they're pieces of fucking cards. See, here's my thing. People complain about the secondary market. You gotta realize, like, if it wasn't for the secondary market, these cards would probably be double the price they are. Because yeah, like, like you would be spending so much to try and actually get these cards out of the pack instead of just buying them off the secondary market. Yep. Yeah. Like. If there was no secondary market for you to just buy off of, like, it never existed. You would either be trying to buy from packs and try to pull, or you'd be buying from vendors who would get to decide the price. And especially since there's no secondary market to refer to for the price, mm. they decide you need the this price. Tiger, huh? <laughs> yeah. How bad do you need it? Mm, pretty bad. Okay, it'll be one kidney. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> take me the mortgage. <laughs> <laughs> I want your left nipple. Your right one's not worth anything. <laughs> Sheep. <laughs> All right, sheeple. I still don't know what this. Um, what were you? Why did you summon Pulau? Why? Why? I, I don't even. I, you know what? I don't even play Pulau. <laughs> I don't like. I only it. <laughs> play one, and the only reason I play it is because if you make a Yazi with uh, a Pulau that can't be destroyed by battle, Cosmo legit can't beat you. Like, there's no outs in the entire deck. Regeki's not an out. Dark Hole's not an out. And then, and they can't be destroyed without battle with... Uh, and then with, Yazi uh, can't be targeted. Oh, they just straight up lose. Yeah. With Beyond, right? Uh, Beyond protection yeah. in battle, right? <laughs> you would go... Um, Pulau, Beyond, uh, Bishi, and a Jiaotu. And then... That is a lot of cards. <laughs> yeah, but like, Cosmo can't beat Yangzing anyway. <laughs> so it's okay. You have time. It's like, oh! Archetype revolves around battle. So does mine. But geez, what are you running to? Do what? You're on two Tiaoti. What are you doing? Tiaoti, right? Is that how you say it? Tiaoti, or it's, I don't know. I can't really tell because it doesn't have the line for the word. <laughs> I, oh my god! Like who runs more of that? I don't even like one. <laughs> I, I hate running one. It's it's already like I'm already unlucky enough to draw it like every game. And you're yeah, just gonna like, run two I, and slap me in the face like this? Like that's how now I feel. I, like if I'm if I'm gonna run, if I'm gonna play Yang Zings on here, then I don't want to run one Tiaoti. I don't want to run one of the Pendulum guy. I forgot his name. Uh, I know I know which one you're talking about. Yeah, the one that searches like your the pendulums because uh, when they die, like they don't float for more Yang Zings. And but at least I get my search of like my, my creation or my path. That's not bad. But if I only run one, I'm gonna draw it and that's. You know, what, Last exactly. thing I want to do is have a Yang Zing and it floats, and then I tribute it to set to play. I've had that to do that float. with Tao Ting. It's so <laughs> bad. It's like I had a Yang Zing on the field, and I had to tribute some of Tao Ting just to make a play, and I felt so disgusting, and awful. Like I should just clean myself. If this Naruto the Flash was actually playing like his deck correctly and actually pulling, he, he should he should have already won this game. Like, like <laughs> yeah, he should have already won this game. Like, there's no he better. Easily time. made a Black Rose on his opponent's turn and went super extra plus. Like, there is no better time to do it. He could have made right. Clear Wing Synchro Dragon. Like, he could have done what? What does this do? I, uh, you left, didn't you? <laughs> You're like, I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> I'm done. Uh, <laughs> I just want to play for different him. Different Yang Zing monsters in the grave. I don't even know. I can't even check your graveyard, so I don't know. What? No. What are you doing? This. I think this. This player is allergic to tuners. It's. <laughs> I think that's what it is. Like, where? Where's your? Where's your Gia? Where's your Chi Wen? Like, what? What is it? <laughs> where are they? Are <laughs> like, no, wait. What are you talking about? Yang Zing and Synchro Deck are just a deck that floats and does nothing but float. <laughs> Maybe if it was against a Shadal player with three Construct. <laughs> <laughs> oh 
Okay. Good play, man. So please don't attack any of the fusions. So so wait wait. Oh yeah, he is stronger than you right now. Cause I forgot about Fright for Tiger boosting. Oh my God! All Fright for monsters you control gain three hundred attack for no, each level monster, and Fright for monster you control. Holy shit! But that's all Yang Zing monsters he controls gains five hundred attack. So he was at twenty seven, and this was at twenty six. <laughs> so you're gonna play your fucking Prana? 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 I don't even know what that word is. Like I've never seen this card ever. Not once. I don't even think All he right. could have done that play. Because uh, the Teate had more attack than the Fluffle. Yep. So, this shouldn't even be happening. Nope. <laughs> but hey, they don't They don't want high-rated people. They don't want to see fucking pro plays with Cosmos and shit. Chain. Okay. <laughs> I'm just... I don't even care. <laughs> okay, I mean, that card really wasn't a threat at all, but... Alright, now what? I don't even know what monsters he used. He used Chi Wen... Like, see, this is the thing. I've never Hulao. seen a Baxia with four different materials put someone in a disadvantageous position. Like, he's still losing. Wow. Yep. <laughs> How so, did you it was Chi four cards with Baxia and still manage to keep losing? So... Bixie, Pulau, Suwani. Wait, does that even add up to and Chi Wen? He used the Taute, which is already five, which means all of the other ones would have had to be in level one. No, because he, he crashed Tiaudi and then summoned Suwani, even though he was in level one. Oh, Suwani, right, right, okay. Yeah, so yeah, so Suwani. So Bixie is. Pulau and Chi Wen, yeah, that's eight. Okay. 2800 that's unaffected by spells and traps. I mean. Can Fluffle run it over? They, yeah, I mean, all he has to do is literally just fuse him to another tiger, Tiger Pop. That's true. Yeah, it, it can be destroyed. What am I saying? Yeah. <laughs> and it's not for some cool, reason they didn't that's... make a fucking Yang Zing that said that the fusion, mo I mean, the Synchro Monster can't be destroyed by card effect. Why? You know why? Because because they're saving the level three tuner to get that effect to the Synchro. It's been a cool minute <laughs> since Yang Zings have got some support, man. You know, <laughs> honestly, Yang Zings don't need support. Worms need support. Just give me like a Worm Rota or. Give me, like, a field spell that does something You bell good me support. Worms. Give me, like, anything. I don't care. Just give me something that does something for worms, and I'll do the rest, okay? <laughs> Just give me a worm. No. Give me a worm Icarus attack. Format over. <laughs> Wait, aren't you already reptiles? Um, No. <laughs> I get what you did there. I had to think. Yeah, I was just saying, wait, aren't you out of your reptiles? Like, what do you need an Icarus attack for? You already got one. <laughs> wow, this man is just doing it up with Probably the just going to make a Castell and win the game, like, right here. Yeah. Or yeah, even better, works. a 101. 101 Castell? You just wreck him? Yep. Is that a Veiler in your hand? No. See, here's the funny part. If he used Taute, he couldn't have made one. He couldn't have used 101. <laughs> Yeah, that's actually funny. <laughs> the one time I can see out would actually put in there work. One one one. All right. Well, at least he still has some Yangzing cards to go ahead and float and stay in the duel. I don't even care. You make a backseat with four materials and still lose the duel. You you, you get out of my face. You disgrace. Yeah, you get out of my face. <laughs> like Naruto the Flash, or like Naruto the Ass. <laughs> Wow, you, that's not a creation? I guess it's a floaty card. This man in his Tao days. I am sick and tired of seeing this fucking Tao I I'm just want him to draw one. <laughs> <laughs> is he really running at, at... Is he running three? Or did he... Or did he put it back? He's running three! Oh my god! There must be wow. two in the grave! Oh, it's only two. Okay. No. no, yeah, you're still manlier than I. <laughs> Damn. Even fucking <laughs> that, he's like, you are manlier than I. <laughs> no balls, no balls. You won't play that many Tiaudis. No balls. <laughs> <laughs> he does play the level six though. <laughs> Not saying anything. <laughs> now what? Do you have anything? Level five. I mean, summon Gia. Why go would and... you not attack and then get your Baxia in the graveyard? 
and then uh, pop your scouting. I, I was you know, you're about to do the play exactly what I said. Summon Gia, go into seven. Yaz, Yazi, Yazi is pretty good. He can't even he can he really can't even handle you. Actually, he would have to go into uh, sheep. Sheep would have to handle you. So he would crash, and then he would come back as 28 and run you over. Because he can't even target you with Tiger right now. So, not bad. It's so mediocre! Okay, so effective Yazi, pop, pop, summon. I mean, he's going to summon one in attack mode, but it's not nearly enough to really... Like, he... Honestly... Ah, oh, man. Like, he could have done so much more. Yep. I'm not even going to go into it, but, like, I... He, you could have done so much more. Cause you're like the Yang Zing master. Yang Zing sensei. And then people were trying to get on me and fucking uh, Vitamin Y saying that my uh, Baxia makes my other Yang Zing this time. I'm like, no, it no. doesn't. I was just it that way. <laughs> That'd be dumb. <laughs> Let me make a boss monster that completely doesn't work with the rest of the deck. <laughs> All right. Then again, I mean, Rainbow Dragon is a card, so like I can't really say. Anything. Oh damn! <laughs> Shots fired. <laughs> Rainbow Dragon is still one of the most booty boss monsters in all of Yu-Gi-Oh. Like I wish, honestly, that there's. Oh, this was. That was game two. Oh, that was How game did nine. Even win game one. <laughs> what? <laughs> Oh my god, that's too good. Alright, you know what? We're gonna go ahead and get one more single dueling for this video. Be right back. Alright, we're gonna keep it low rated style. So we got Lemman44 here, only 221, and Skyfire only 9. I mean, 9. Oh, I really want him to be a high rank. 195. <laughs> <laughs> I really want him to be a high rank. Or at least it looks like it. Alright, so. Nothing higher than tier 2, please? I would appreciate it. Drop uh, the killer mirror magic. <laughs> you, you're going first. Okay, I have to say. This one's like seriously thinking. So this is obviously a Cosmo deck. Yep, obviously a Cosmo deck because everybody knows that Cosmo set. I don't think I've ever seen a Cosmo deck set. I don't think I've seen that either. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really trying to think. Unless I use Book of Moon on one. <laughs> Which so we got the X-Saber. Oh, oh, I know when I've seen the Cosmo deck. It's a mirror match where a good witch set something. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> hey, yeah. X-Saber is. All right. Mr. Steel, your girl. Yeah. <laughs> okay, Knight. Pashul. I don't know. Or he on Lake. There we I, go. I, 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 wait. What's, what's up? Bogart Knight? I thought Bogart Knight was one. I, he used a two and a four. What monster did he summon? Uh, the did level two possibly... guy who can't be destroyed by battle. Are sure was level two? I could have sworn he was level one. Yeah. Nah, he's level two. Alright. I was going to say, I know I'm not crazy. I, I might be a little bit crazy. Karakuris! Oh, he breaks. Did you get Karakuri? Brick card curry. <laughs> X Saber versus fucking Gurgia Katakuri? What is this fucking 2010? <laughs> I had to think about it. <laughs> like, what year was that? Karakuri came out in, I think, Return of the. No, I'm doing D Rev. What am I saying? I think it came out in D Rev. The same set as Duality. Oh, I love Duality. <laughs> Except for that time that it made it a fucking duel in Vitamin Y Life Street because I'm an idiot. <laughs> Wow, I mean... This is the most aggressive Karakuri deck I've ever seen. I might have <laughs> deck this guy. <laughs> like, he is just obviously... Like, is it is it Gear Gear Karakuri? Or is it just Karakuri? I feel like it's just pure Karakuri. I don't think I've ever seen that in my entire life. Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh! <laughs> what? What was that? I'm gonna get another duel. And it's going to be entertaining. And not fucking just people scooping it up because of stupid shit. We are back. Alright. Back. So. Low rated duelist. That's what we're going to do. <laughs> I'm not trying to make fun of them at all. So we got What the Flamingo here. At 472. And we got Sir Kingsley. The Royal Penis. 
Oh. Oh. God. Oh God. Well, oh, I mean, God. the deck's not dead. You just gotta hope and pray that Sarah Kingsley doesn't have a solemn warning set, or you're just gonna fucking end I yourself. I mean, that effect doesn't activate; it just applies. yeah, it doesn't activate. Yep. <clears throat> yep. Well, at least it wasn't the Kana Hawk, because <laughs> then we would be here for a while. Yep. <laughs> I've never the liked this deck. <laughs> I said I have never liked this deck. I faced this deck so many times in regionals; it's not even funny. And I beat it every time. <laughs> Ever since I just started citing Triple Iron Wall in like legit every deck I play, I just haven't lost to this. Wow. Okay. Wow. Okay. I mean, well, I guess I you can tag out if something happens. Yeah, so I, I thought he was maybe gonna, you know, just touch himself, but I guess he's like, no, I'm good. I'm just trying to go, go for that defensive. early offense. Yep, okay. early offense. I don't know. Maybe things would have been different if he would have went first. Why did you not just do that before? Do that, before. that way, your Leo would have been banished. Oh well, I guess it doesn't make a difference. <laughs> this complete silence. Like, is that a fucking scary thing? For... <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. And this is what you guys wanted. <laughs> Fuck singing them cosmos. We want to see motherfucking Spirit Reaper. It's fucking Spirit Reaper right up on my channel. All right. Okay. <laughs> All right. There is nothing competitive, nothing higher than fucking tier fucking two in this video. I better not see a fucking single dislike. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. All right. There's Ken Hawk. Wow. Got that ambush. It's really yep. dangerous to set up a Kanahawk that can't tag out now. Yep. Oh, you are so lucky your opponent can't run that over. Yep, you are so lucky you can't run that over, because if he could, you'd be in some deep shit. Can it tag out? Oh, okay. I didn't see oh, okay. Not being able to view the Banish Zone, you know. Yep. I don't know why they won't let you do that on here. They say it's for cheating, but you could argue that allowing it would technically prevent cheating because it would let the watchers correct moves mm -hmm. so I, I, wait how does that how does that cheat oh damn get the fuck <laughs> out of here with that garbage ass ambush i mean technically it was a plus one if you look at what the result could have been yeah but oh well there you uh, go <laughs> never mind. You didn't see, so you can target and you're dying anyway so well i hope your one back row can stop what's about to happen yep <laughs> Wow, uh, fucking oh, dark ride. What, what the hell? Like, I don't want to give any spoilers and try to time it, but we're seeing some cards that we kind of saw in our tag duel. <laughs> don't even. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh my it's god. Right this Sir uh, like Flamingo, this Sir Kingsley has your fucking number, man. I mean, he's slowly going neg, so... Yeah, he's slowly just powering out of resources. Ulti can arc again? Like, nothing hide... What what tier is this deck now? Did it drop down to, like, tier 2 now? I all... think it's, like, tier question mark, honestly. Because no one plays it, but it's still good. Yeah, no. It's just like, like, okay, you have one... Nothing. It's not like you can't loop it still. Just be careful of leaving it without being able to tag out and watch out for that solemn warning. Now, when notice comes out, no. Yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> hmm, Summon kind of hawk notice. <laughs> oh, the where is this man going? Beast. Not stopping kind of hawk from attacking whatsoever. Oh, yeah, that doesn't even stop kind of hawk from <laughs> fucking you up. <laughs> kind of hawk beat down confirmed. What? What? Are, are you stalling? Is this some kind of Exodia, weird Exodia deck? Because I was threatening war. Spirit Reaper. Imagine you, are you playing Exodia? Uh, what are you doing? You know, once I made a deck that was just straight up 60 cards to stall, and you would just deck your opponent out because you just stall so much. Oh, I thought you were just stalling just to stall. Like, no, nah, I just stall until I lose. <laughs> <laughs> no, it was just, it was literally stall. It was worse than Final Countdown. And your opponent didn't even want to touch you, did they? You're like, I, I, you know what? I don't got time for this. I got shit to do today. Okay. 
So you're gonna go ahead and uh target one part card your opponent controls. So what are you gonna put back into his hand? The messenger piece? No, it's, it's a random set card. Alright. Oh my god! <laughs> you can hear them! <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> I'm recording! You're so loud! <laughs> like, that's all the way upstairs. Like, hello? <laughs> I'm done. I'm done. I swear to God. Well, you're not missing much. No, I'm not missing much. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm sitting here racking my brain trying to figure out what the hell freaking Kingsley's playing. But, hey. Is it safe to assume that uh, Kingsley is clearly going to win the game? Oh. Oh. <laughs> yeah. That might have been the first time that I've ever seen this deck XE. I mean, I know that they can do Lightning like Chidori, but I've just never seen them do it. It's because, it's, yeah, it's that's because they're always too busy fucking playing with their fucking ulti can hop. I mean, it's also because the ambush doesn't let you exceed. Oh, okay. Like, it says, I think, yeah, you can't special summon um, for the rest of the turn except Ritual Beast, I think. That's oh, what it says. Okay. Alright, well, I guess you're gonna fuck him up. Is that it? I Are mean, we actually yeah. gonna go this entire duel fucking not knowing what Kingsley was playing? I mean, screw actually seeing some Cosmo plays and some competitiveness. Nah. We gotta be fucking random shit. Like you said, we'll try low rated. We'll try low rated. I'm not making fun of anybody. I'm just gonna. If something dumb happens, I'm just gonna sit here speechless. That's it. <laughs> it's gonna take every single fiber of my being not to just be like. <laughs> I tried so hard. I tried because every single fiber of my being in this duel just makes me want to just go to Kingsley, point at his cards, and be like, "I only got one question for you." <laughs> <laughs> what are you? <laughs> <laughs> like I, I don't know I don't know it seems like it's a, some kind of stall deck but I don't know honestly a lot of low rated players like they put in a bunch of stall but their deck doesn't always have like an actual purpose it's just like hopefully I do enough damage and stall for long enough and I'll win but yeah, I'm, I'm it's generally not out. a strategy that you really want to go with you stall out and then I'm gonna summon big strong monsters and I'm gonna beat him caveman style summon blue eyes what you gonna do about my blue eyes <laughs> Oh my god, is that actually How is that a good game? How is, is that, that a good, good game? game? <laughs> How is that a good game? Are you gonna actually give it if you guys get a rematch then I'll 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 humor you guys. But if not, oh wow, they're oh. actually gonna get a rematch. You know what? <laughs> you know what? Fuck it, I'll I'll humor you guys. I'll humor you. Fuck it. Fuck it, I'll do it. I'm starving. Uh, eat a dick. That's good advice. <laughs> <laughs> I am also hungry, not for dick. So, um... <laughs> uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh! 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 Oh my! <laughs> That escalated quickly. Yep. So that's what you were playing. I mean, I don't know why you would do that right now. Just, all you have to do is activate MST and you lose the game. Yep. Like, why can't these players just wait until they have game instead of, you know... Because if I was his opponent, you would try and, like... You know what I mean? You don't want your opponent to know what you're playing if they don't know. No, Chen resolves backwards. No, he did it right. <clears throat> wow, now they're, now they're trying to fucking rule shark. Oh my god. Oh my god, do you. Flamingo, Chen resolves backwards. Well, if he act. No, if he activated Samochi first, then that's the opposite of what he wanted to do. Wait, he fucked it up? Really? Yeah, he did. He used Samochi first, and it hasn't resolved yet, and then he used Gift Card, and then the Path to Destiny. So he just gamed himself. 
It's not Cosmo. <laughs> <laughs> I guess so. That's the word that you. No, no. I get no, no. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Yeah, you activate the the switching burn at the end. Yeah, I guess he's like, fine. He's I'll be nice. So yeah, you fucked that up. Cause... I mean, he if he's letting this go, he probably has a pretty nice hand. Yeah, yeah, he opened up an elder and he's about to go to town, so. Elder anything, GG. <laughs> oh, oh, here we go. He doesn't give a shit. He's about to beat your ass. <laughs> I could have one life point. <laughs> oh my god. One eternity later. Uh huh. This video is already half an hour. Why? Oh, 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 okay. No, never mind. He's doing it right. He's doing it right. It's been a while. It's been a while. That's why. Can they, they have to do that twice since it's changed or something? Yeah, you're not supposed to use uh, Kanahawk on the first banishing. You're supposed to use it on the second one. Like, you can go into it. You just don't use the effect. Because you have to use... You have to end up with four in your banish pile, like he did here. Oh, okay. So if, if he made Kanahawk and then <coughs> used its effect right away, he would have only had three in his banish pile. Oh. And then he can't do... The super majiggly wombo combo -ness. Yep. I think that might be game unless he... I mean, it doesn't even matter because at this point, like, anything wins the game. Even Lightning Chidori wins the game again, which is funny. Yeah. Little do you know that Sir Kingsley is going to rip into another gift card. <laughs> Why'd you get out caught? You know it's going to happen. <laughs> I want to see it happen... <laughs> but I, I'm afraid he won't get a turn. Oh my god. If he's able to end this this turn, I mean, his trap cards aren't even active until at least next turn. You know, it looks like he's going the... S See, I disagree with this. It's like, why would you go set a bunch of monster hate when this deck doesn't even run monsters like that? Yep. Like, why would you not just put damage on the board? Oh, damn. Like, look at this. If I swear to God, if you lose... Okay. Oh. I mean, that's one way of handling things, but... Yep. That's nothing that... Ugh, I don't know. I just feel like he should have searched a bunch of stuff and then attacked. Because his opponent's only at 6,000. He probably actually could have had game. Especially if we search the quick play. What are you doing? How are you going to defense mode? He's not. He's chatting. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was saying, you can't even yeah. activate your effect to do anything. Like, you sit there. Now go ahead and flip up that. Wow. All right. There we go. Let's say, go ahead okay. and flip up that set gift card and end this duel. <laughs> Noob. <laughs> In that. Oh my god. Alright. That was, that was, there you go. He got that last insult in. Yeah, he had to get that in there. He was already gone. But... <laughs> anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed. So, there. Not irate. So, not not even one. Not even one dislike. It wasn't Cosmo. It wasn't Cosmo. <laughs> so, thank you forever, Epic, for joining me. Yeah. And, uh,. He'll, of course, be back on the channel. He'll be joining me for Daily Duels as well. So come back a couple hours and see that as well. So thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. And, yep, see you guys uh, next time, next week with some more Dando commentary.